All right, so we know the Brooks community. We've seen it evolve over the last 20 or so years, and it keeps getting bigger and better. They have a huge vision in mind as well. That is why joining us in today's Leading Essay segment is Connie Gonzalez. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Good morning, Connie. Good morning. Thank you for having us. So for those who don't know, what does Brooks really mean to San Antonio? Sure. So Brooks is an economic hub. It's truly a model that should be replicated across the city of San Antonio. When the Air Force Base closed down almost 21 years ago, the fact that many city leaders, uh, state leaders, and even uh, federal leaders decided to convey the land to one team, which is us, Brooks Development Authority, to redevelop 1,308 acres was the best thing that could have happened after an Air Force Base closed down. Oh my gosh, for anyone that's been down there, I mean, it's incredible and beautiful uh, what, what the development that has occurred there. So Texas and San Antonio has seen a huge economic development over the last few years, more businesses and people moving down those cities. So what has Brooks seen? We've seen the same, if not more, Sarah. We have officially surpassed 1.2 billion with a B in development that's already completed. And I'm happy to report that we have another 425 million in projects underway today. And so despite the pandemic, we have still been rocking and rolling and our projects are moving. We're inviting more people to live, work, learn, play and stay at Brooks in the southeast side of San Antonio. Love the idea. And, and you know, looking through the vision, so many big things are playing. Can you tell us a little bit about this like widespread vision? What does, say, the next 10 years or so look like? Sure. So Brooks was created for regional prosperity. If 10, 15, 20 years from now were an island of prosperity, we did not achieve our mission and vision. We are a tool to uplift those in our surrounding communities. And so how are we doing so? We're attracting businesses. We're attracting jobs. How are we attracting jobs? By creating all things where you can live, work, learn, play, and stay. So we have apartments. We have employers. We have the only full service hotel. And we have an amazing amazing 43 acre park, which you see right behind me, which now connects to the San Antonio River Mission Reach. So regional prosperity is what Brooks is all about. I love that trail and I love that it's connected. I, I walk it with my dogs. So what are some other projects our community should know about? So many projects. I mentioned the 425 million underway. I'll start off with another first that we've been able to achieve for the southeast side. And that's not one, but that's two Class A office buildings uh, totaling 200,000 square feet, again, of Class A office space. In addition, we have 800,000 square feet underway of light industrial space. And the fun stuff that you all want to know about, right? Where are we going to eat and drink? We're happy to be home of the newest La Gloria, thanks to Chef Johnny Hernandez and joining him soon thereafter will be BJ's Brew House, Outback Steakhouse, Pluckers, Dave's Hot Chicken, and I cannot wait to announce the many more concepts that we'll be inviting to Brooks. And so we see such a huge influx of people coming to Texas, coming to San Antonio for families moving to the Alamo City. You know, make the pitch. Why Brooks? You can do all things. I challenge you all. Where can you live, work, learn, play, and because we have hotels, where can you stay on 1,300 acres anywhere else in the city of San Antonio? I challenge you, you can't, but you can do all of those things um, at Brooks across 1,300 acres in close proximity, uh, just 10 minutes south of downtown. And so um, we'll be doubling our res residential population over the next uh, three to five years. Today, we have about 2,000. I look forward to surpassing that 5,000 mark of those people that choose to live at Brooks because you can do all things. I swear, every time I drive down there, there is another <laughs> restaurant popping up, a new business. Oh, great things really happening at Brooks. Connie Gonzalez with Brooks, thank you so much for joining us this morning. And for our viewers, you can find this full interview on KSAT.com later in the morning. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.